All right, what's going on, everyone? This is Vintage Rom Guy bringing you the next system test video. Happy Final Friday. This will be system test number 54. So, anyway, let's go ahead and let's get started. So, last system test, I obviously did the true alerts, if any of you guys have remembered. Um, I promised in the last system test, I was going to do both electromechanical and electronic. Well, I always stick with my promises right here. So, for today's system test, we're doing both electronic and electromechanical today. So, I guess right off the bat with things, let's go ahead and let's get started with devices. So for the pulse station next to the panel, still got the 2999 up still from the last cold system test. I am going to be swapping this out for probably something else. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to put up yet, but I know all I do know is I think next system test, I'm probably going to swap this out for something else. So, yep. But if we go above that, I actually got a new alarm in my collection. Uh, this right here is a Gentex GMS. This is pretty much a red wall mount electromechanical horn stroke. This is pretty much basically the exact same thing as the SHG, except this year it's electromechanical. So you can actually probably tell is, you know, the horn is actually silver, it's a uh, black. And also it does not have the extra four um, mounting holes on it, like compared to the SHG where it actually does have it. And the SHG is actually electronic instead of electromechanical. So, yep. Pretty cool alarm. I actually been wanting one of these for quite some time, and now finally got one of these. So, pretty cool to have just one of these in my collection now. So, pretty cool. All right. Over here, I replaced the Simplex 2098-9636 with the Ansel SLT24F. I figured I swapped this out for a change. And then going over here by the door, I got the AIP or the Alarm Industry Products. Rebrand Edward Susan SP over here. And above it, I got my Gentex SHG to kind of go with the Gentex GMS over there. So, yep. this unit is actually electronic. And yeah, you can probably tell this one does have the extra four uh, mounting holes. And you can see the horn is actually black because this is actually electronic horn. And that device over there is electromechanical. So, pretty cool. Now, one thing I'm going to also mention about both these horn strokes, both these horn strokes are actually on two wire operation, so there's going to really be no audible silence today. So I have that device is on two wire operation, but I have to cut the jumpers on it to or, in order to make that thing a four wire alarm. So, but I'm not going to cut the jumpers right now. I might probably cut the jumpers on that thing eventually at some point, but I think in the meantime, I'm just going to leave that on two wire operation for now. And then for the SHG, this thing's already on two wire operation because I, um, Put this thing on uh, two wire operation for the system test. It's a four wire operation. So, yep. All right. That was pretty much the overview of all the devices here on the system. As you can see, we've got kind of like an older Gentex themed with the, like these Gentex, older Gentex horn strobes right here. So, and for any of you guys that really like Gentex alarms or, or pretty much a Gentex pe person or anything like that, well, you guys are here for a treat. So, I'm going to be doing Gentex for the system test right here. So, I guess without further ado, I guess there's nothing else to say here about the system. So, I guess let's go ahead and get on with the test. So, let's start off by the door today, just because I haven't started off over here in a while. So, anyway, let's go ahead and we'll start things off with the AIP 270 SPO. I have the system on continuous. If you have any epilepsy, the flashing strobe lights or flashing lights, please do not watch this video. Anyway, let's pull a fire alarm. Like I said, no audible silence because both of these are on uh, two hour operations. So, yep. all right. So anyway, I think, I think we're gonna go ahead and let's realarm the system with the Ansel smoke detector. So, on top of this, got the good old Magnic on a pair of vice grips for good luck. So, yep. 
put this against the detector here. Man, I'll tell you what, that GMS is incredibly loud. Sounds like a lot louder than SHG, so, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's the point of electric mechanical horns, because they sound louder than electronics, so, yeah. I could have recorded this earlier today, but apparently, I actually tried to record the system test earlier, but my phone decided to, like, shut off for some reason. I don't know why, yeah. So, and then, like, for some reason, it, like, stopped recording and didn't even save it, so... Yeah, apparently I'm recording this at night time, as you could probably tell. I think it's like pretty much like 6 o'clock p.m. at night, so yeah. yeah. Alright, anyway, I guess without further ado, let's go ahead and activate the last initiating device here on the system. 299-9754. And I think while I'm at it, I'll probably do a quick lights out test. So I'm going to try to make this pretty fast because you know, I don't want to keep this on for too long because it's getting really late outside. So anyway, let's get this party started. <laughs> God, continuous. <laughs> yeah. Why did I choose continuous for the system test? <laughs> I don't know, but that was pretty stupid, but <laughs> yeah. That's pretty much what new age server alarm pretty much say, so we put the panels are set and boom, just like that. Alright. Alright, so that pretty much wraps up for system test number fifty four. Yep. Good old electromechanical Gentex GMS. And a good old electronic SHG over there. So, yep, pretty cool alarms. I mean, yeah, that's pretty much a good old, well, I guess, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. All right, so I think next system test, um, cause like, let's see. Actually, I think next system test, I'm gonna probably try to do something with like chimes and bells next system test because, um, I think next week, I believe it's next week, I'm going to be doing, um, kind of like a Christmas system test. So, Yep, so I think next system test, I'm gonna probably do something with like chimes and bells. So, yeah, day this is gonna be uploaded on will probably be December 18th. And the next system test, when we do bells and chimes, is gonna be uploaded on Christmas, which is December 35th. No, 25th. <laughs> yeah, man, I can't talk today. Yeah, so that's kind of what I got planned for next week. So, yep. So, anyway, that was pretty much the GMS and the SHG over there. So, yeah. I think next I would like to try to get is the Gentex GOS, which is multi-tone. Yeah, it's that device. It's like, like the GOS is like, it's like a little bit like the SHGO there, being electronic. But that device is multi-tone and it sounds a lot like the system sensor mass. So, yeah. I am planning on probably getting a GOS eventually at some point. So, that way I'll have like all three of like the older, um, horn strobes and stuff like that. So, yep. 
So that's why I kind of like got plants. So, yeah. all right. So that's pretty much wraps up for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all next week for the next Final Friday. Have a great day, everyone.